A Waco man is helping educate people on the history of the jump shot, a classic technique in basketball. Six News reporter Cole Johnson joins us and Cole, how's he doing it? Hey Leslie, Ty Nathan Clark is producing a movie about Kenny Saylor, showing us all how he made a lasting legacy on the game of basketball. My name is Ty Nathan Clark and I am an artist and a filmmaker here in Waco, Texas. Ty Studio in Waco is what you would typically think of. Paints, canvases, completed pieces, and the man himself working on his art. But in the studio, there's a hint of another passion of Ty's. I played basketball for a long time, so I played collegiately. Um, I tried to play overseas, um, had a number of injuries that kind of held me back. And this was really just a way for me to come back in and give myself a little bit of closure in basketball. I've been a producer on an incredible film called Jump Shot. For where would basketball be without Kenny Sailors and what is known today as the Jump Shot? There was a time where guys shot with two hands on the ground, just a really just a slow push out. And there, there was a number of guys that started jumping and shooting a ball. Um, but the guy that we credit, Kenny Sailors, who's our character in the film, he really developed the one handed jump shot that you see today in the game of basketball. Do you know who that guy is? No. I don't know, because I mean, I'm a millennial, so I just thought the jump shot was just a part of the game. Ty has been part of the project for five years working to tell Kenny's story. The film had a lot of really old kind of historian guys at the time, but no real basketball clout. And the character of our film was such an incredible inspiration that they just jumped at a chance to be a part of the story. It's a look at history and a man's role in shaping one of the biggest sports in the world. Now, if you want to see the movie, it's a one day only showing on April 2nd and it'll be in Waco at the AMC Classic Galaxy 16 Theater. For more details, go to KCNTV.com after this newscast. Leslie. All right. Sounds great. Thanks, Cole.